extremely pregnant mom of quadruplets shows off her babies after delivery. The human body is truly an amazing thing. If you don't believe that, you might have forgotten about the miracle of pregnancy. When a woman gets pregnant, she undergoes hundreds of changes to her physical and mental state. There are so many obstacles to overcome for conception to even happen, and that's before the pregnancy itself. What's even more of a miracle is when a woman gets pregnant with more than one baby. There's around a 1 in 250 chance of giving birth to twins, so it's not as rare as you might think. But the odds of having triplets is 1 in 62,500. And the odds of having quadruplets is around 1 in every 15,625,000 pregnancies. So when Simon and Lindsay Hay learned they were having four babies, they were understandably overwhelmed. The New Jersey couple were already parents to one child, but their journey to natural conception for the second time wasn't easy. Lindsay went through several miscarriages before doctors revealed that she had poor egg quality, making it highly unlikely that she would ever conceive naturally again. Like many parents in their situation, Lindsay and Simon considered IVF. But before then, they were advised by doctors to try a more affordable solution, an injection hormone called folistim. Explaining about folistim to BuzzFeed, Lindsay said, The theory behind the drugs was if I produced more than one egg per cycle, I'd catch a good one faster. We had to try this, plus timed intercourse six times before moving on to IVF. Most parents will know that trying for babies makes all that sexy bedroom stuff seem suddenly unsexy. But for many of us, the hope of eventually conceiving encourages us to will preserve. Thankfully for Lindsay and Simon, the folistim treatment gave them what they were looking for, and more. Lindsay discovered that she was pregnant with quadruplets. There are risks associated with any pregnancy, but when you're giving birth to four babies, thankfully, ultrasounds showed that the babies were developing fine. Of course, Lindsay's pregnancy wasn't easy, mentally or physically. She had fears and anxiety leading up to her due date, as well as sickness and nausea. When she was 20 weeks into her pregnancy, Lindsay was told by doctors to restrict her movements as her cervix was getting thin. Finally, at 30 weeks and 4 days, it was time for Lindsay's four miracle babies to be delivered. Throughout her pregnancy, Lindsay had documented the whole thing on Instagram, showing off her huge baby bump. When she gave birth successfully via C-section, she was able to share a few precious photos of her babies before they were wheeled off to NICU. The tiny newborn spent seven weeks in hospital, where they were finally allowed home and, luckily, all four were healthy. Nowadays, Lindsay has her hands full as the mom of five small children. Understandably, she doesn't share updates as frequently as she used to. From what she does share, though, you can tell she's loving motherhood. Lindsay confirmed this herself when she shared a post that was captioned, I rarely get a minute to myself. I'm constantly in motion and have learned how to move quickly and multitask. I sleep less, I worry more, but I will say this. The expression, full hands, fuller hearts, has never resonated with me more. I'm so overjoyed with happiness and fulfillment, and every day I wake up wondering how I got so lucky. I have everything I prayed for and more. We are so blessed. Congrats to Lindsay and Simon, and let's hope they're not missing out on too many hours of sleep. Please share this with your friends and family.